G'day, g'day, and welcome to another episode of Kiwi Car Life. And now that I've had my Z4 for a little over eight months, I think it gives me a great opportunity to let you know the seven things that I absolutely love about this car. The first thing that I absolutely love about my Z4 is the way that it looks. In the Panda spec, as I call it, white exterior with black accents and a black interior, I just think it looks absolutely stunning. It's a lot less polarizing than the designs of BMW's previous sports cars, the Z3 and the E85 Z4. I just feel like this one is a much more beautiful, smooth, flowing design. The second thing that I love about it is the sound. This 2.5 litre straight six just makes such a lovely, lovely noise. So many engines today barely rev anywhere over, you know, 6,000 RPM, but this goes all the way to seven. It might be just a 323i engine, you know, nothing particularly special, but my goodness does it sound good. The third thing that I've been really impressed by with this car is the transmission performance. If I put it in normal mode and use manual mode, listen to how it shifts. It's smooth, it's quite slow if I'm honest, and it kind of shifts like every other ZF6 car that I've driven. You know, most 323i's that you get in will shift like that. But that's not why I'm impressed by this, because if I'm honest, out of sport mode, it's pretty average. But you put it into sport mode, and now it's quite different. It has gear shock, it shifts hard into the next gear. The steering gets heavier. The throttle response gets sharper and using the pedals it just works so well and obviously a manual would be nice to have but the fact is the auto shifts so well and is so engaging to use with the pedals that I actually really don't mind to be honest and the fourth thing I love is the handling this thing's on some pretty bald tyres, I need to really put some new tyres on it, and yeah. It handles so well, but when you push it, it still has a hint of oversteer, which is perfect. Gotta say, every now and then, you, know, you get it out on the road like this. And my goodness does it handle well. The steering feel is excellent, like seriously good. You know exactly what the front end's doing. It weights up through turns beautifully. And it just sits flat and balanced on the road. So many convertible sports cars I've driven, they just feel roly-poly, you know, because they're light, there's no mass to push it into the road. Whereas because this is just that little bit heavy, you know, 13, 1400 kilos, it just feels plant it. The fifth thing that I love about this car is just the daily drivability. Once you've had your fun and games, you can take it out of sport mode, put it into D and just cruise. Not out to thrash the pants off anything, just enjoying the soft top experience, the sun going down, the nice smooth winding roads and the like. And for that this car is excellent. It can do everything. It can be comfortable and smooth and quiet when you want but it can whip up a back road at the same time. It's just lovely. The sixth thing that I love about this car is the features and the comfort. I've driven a lot of convertibles and most of them are very cramped inside and hardly have any features at all because they go, oh, well, the feature is the driving experience and so on. But what I look for in a convertible is one that you can enjoy the open top experience, as I've mentioned, but one that is also great to drive every single day and this ticks that bill. It's got auto lights, auto wipers, all sorts of buttons on the steering wheel, paddle shifters, the iDrive system up here has New Zealand navigation which works excellently for reversing camera. Some of these came with Bluetooth but it also has a very comprehensive trip computer that shows your range, your trip distance, your fuel consumption. It's got heated seats and it's quiet, it's comfortable and it's featuresome. And the final thing that I really love about my Z4 is that in the right conditions, I'll admit it's not really a very good sideways machine, but in the right conditions, 
you can have a little bit of fun with it. <laughs> so there we go, that's seven reasons why I absolutely love my Z4. Above all else, it just puts a smile on my face and that's kind of the metric that I use for cars. And I still remember the first time I drove one and when I got out, I was like, I've got to have one of these. Now, eagle-eyed viewers on Trade Me may have spotted and a few people have commented as well that they were like, hang on, you love your car so much and yet you've got it for sale. And I'm like, well, I was kind of hoping you guys wouldn't see that, but some people have spotted that yes, it is on Trade Me. And there's a very good reason for that. And that's because it's brilliant and I can't really fault it, but I can't own three cars at the same time. I have this, I have the Accord, and I have uh, a work car and it's just not working. They just sit around, I'm constantly cleaning them because they're always sitting outside. And I've decided that the time has come where I need to go back to just a work car and just a fun car. Thanks very much for watching this episode of Kiwi Car Life. I hope you enjoyed it and it's given you maybe a little more of a look into this Z4, why I bought it, why I love it. And I'll look forward to seeing you again next time.